everyone welcome in this video i'm going to talk about how you can create agents without any code using lizer ai yes you heard me right we can create some complex workflows and agents reliably without writing any code so that is what uh, we can do with lizer ai so currently as you can see i'm on their website and uh, you can see a host of features that they offer so now we will navigate to agent studio which is a platform which allows us to create agents from scratch so let me go to agent studio this is the home page for lizer ai agent studio as you can see there are host of different options that are present here so i'll just brief briefly walk you through the interface first and then we will start with the creation of our first ai agent so first let us go to the agents part in this you can access all the agents that you have created before and even if you want to create a new agent you can just click on create new and get started with it and there is a feature of knowledge base so let's say if you want your agent to be connected to a particular knowledge base it could be a website it could be a set of pdfs or other documents as well so you can create a custom knowledge base for each agent and going to the models part you can see currently lizer ai supports host of different models from open ai anthropic google and even deep seek as well and there are many more models that are coming soon and let us go to the tools part and this is one of the most interesting parts about lizer ai because whenever we are creating any ai agents we want to connect it to some external applications so let's say you want an agent that sets up meetings for you on google calendar or sends mails to you so in this you can configure any tools so let's say currently i have already added a twitter tool so adding a tool is also very easy you can just click on add and you can directly uh, authenticate it so that way you can see uh, a lot of uh, tools that are already there and they are constantly adding even more tools so these tools allow us to connect our agents to external applications so that we can deploy it in some real life applications as well so that is going to be very useful in the examples that i'm going to show you before as well and there is a data connectors feature that will let you connect it to any external vector databases as well so this this is a brief overview of the lizer ai agent studio platform first of all uh, we will start get started with creating a agent that will help us automate our social media content generation so let's say if i want to post uh, post on twitter regularly so instead of me having to go to twitter write post and do post by myself every time so can i actually use an agent where i just ask it uh, some instructions and it will automatically post on my behalf so that is what i will try to do so before that uh, you will actually need to add a tool for twitter so you can go to the tools and just add uh, uh, twitter in your tools before you get started and then navigate to the agents part and you can just click on create new so there are a lot of options here so let us go through each of them one by one so the first is agent name so you can just give it any name you want so let's say i want uh, this to be a twitter automation tool so let me just name it that this is the basic name that i've given so it's called twitter automation agent and the description is an agent that automates social media post generation for twitter and now i can select any llm provider so let me select google and let me select gemini 2 flash experimental so this is one of the good models that is available there so i'll just click on this so the next step is going to be very important where we will actually define the role for ai agents and we will also mention instructions so you can understand this to be like system prompt for the agent so this is going to be very important so let me just fill up these and as you can see this is the agent role that i am defining so the agent role goes something like this you are an expert social media manager your task is to compile latest news on ai from twitter and create engaging tweets of posting so currently we can give it any topic and give it some context and it will write some engaging posts for social media and here we are actually giving some instructions for the agent to follow so these are the instructions so these instructions will be available in the comment so you can uh, take that as well so once you have written the agent role and instructions the next part is to define the tools so for this since we are going to use uh, twitter for posting so let me just choose twitter and you can just mention ai how you want it to use uh, this tool so we want ai to use this tool to write uh, social media post so the task that i've given to this is uh, creation of twitter post so whenever agent sees that it has to create any twitter post or anything it will use this tool 
and you can give some examples on how we want the tone to look like and which is also a very uh, useful way so let's say if you want a particular format of the tweet to come out so you can copy paste your agents but for now i'll just leave it as it is and there are a lot of other core features also that are available so knowledge base and memory i'll shortly cover it in the next agent that we are going to develop but for now let us just use the humanizer part so whenever you are generating news or articles from ai they are rather more robotic sounding so humanizer allows us to make it more human looking so that is why i have chosen this that's it we just had to enter the name instructions model and tools and we are done with creating our agent so this is all we had to do let me just say create and let me just update so it says that it's updated our twitter so let me go back to my twitter and show you the latest post that i've made and now we will see that whenever i ask it to create a new post it should actually create one for me as you can see i have last made a post uh, around 2 3 days back so there is no tweet that i've made in the last 2 3 days so let us give a topic to our lizer agent and let us see if it is able to generate a tweet automatically or not so i'm back on the platform and what i want to do is i want to write a tweet on the how influential the transformers architecture has been so let us uh, write a quick query and send it to the agent and let us check if it is actually writing a twitter post or not as you can see this is the prompt that i'm writing so the prompt is write a brief post on impact of transformers architecture so let me just correct the spelling this is the prompt and let me just send it to the agent so you can see that the agent is thinking based on whatever information that we have given it it will take a couple of seconds and we can check back on twitter whether it has made a post for this or not as you can see uh, it is actually writing a post uh, about transformers architecture so this is the post so let me go back to my twitter and see if it has made this post or not so let me refresh this so you can see right so i just asked it to post and uh, just 27 seconds ago it has actually posted a twitter on my account directly so this is how easy it is to connect an ai agent to external tools and create them very easily so let me test it out with one more prompt this is my next prompt where i'm asking it to write a tweet about benefits of open source ai so let me just run this and it is taking a couple of seconds so it has taken around 10 seconds only and it has given us this tweet so let us check back on the twitter whether we have it posted or not as you can see so this is the post that we have open source ai is revolutionizing ai tech land as you can see this is how i am able to automate my uh, twitter post generation just by giving it a simple prompt and the posts are directly on the platform i would strongly recommend you to try out this tool with your own models with your own prompt templates and you can try it for different purposes as well in the next video i will show you how you can create a rag agent using lizer ai until then stay tuned